everyone, Zach with Magnum Bikes here. Today we're going to go over some basic functionalities on the Magnum Cruiser. We're going to start with the battery, power that on with the toggle switch on the battery, as well as the switch on the handlebar here. You're going to see the handle or the display light up there. Alright, and we're ready to ride. So, let's go over some of the functions of the bike. Mounted here with our makeshift stand. So, what I'm going to do is ride it around, and with my camera here, I'm going to capture how everything works from the rider's perspective. A little bike anatomy first, though. On my left-hand side here, you're going to see our front brake. On my right-hand side here, you're going to see the rear brake, the gear shift, the throttle, as well as our bell. Back to my left-hand side, we have the controller for our speed settings, as well as the backlight on the power button. Can't really see because it's sunny, but it does work. Set button here is going to control our odometer and trip timers there. You can see on the bottom left hand corner, it's cycling through. Back to odometer there. Now, PAS on the display. That's your level of pedal assist. Right now we're in one, and that's what we'll start at. So let's get going. Cadence sensor will pick up movement. We'll start going. There we are. Now, on these bikes, as a class three, you can attain a top speed of 28 miles an hour, which is achieved by going to level six. For this demonstration in our parking lot today we're not going to be doing that but you sure can now as far as shifting gears go you'll notice that the gear shift if you can see that it is an eighth gear if i rotate it towards me you're going to notice those numbers going down seven six five those are going to shift you into a bigger easier gear for climbing hills and such and then if we go back down it's going to shift you into a smaller harder gear you can really gather speed on flat ground and hit that 28 miles an hour Let's turn here that was great for commuting and that's about it. There's a basic rundown of a C7 display on a Magnum Cruiser. Thanks.